All right, everybody, I thought I'd give y'all an update with the Lawson and Company, their auction, because they have added a lot of cars. The auction's October 15th, and the original six that were out here, it's like tripled. This Grand National is one of the ones I was here before. Old Mercedes. I would guess like a 38 Chevy. This Mustang, I think they had tried auctioning it before. This one had been here at a different time. So it must have had a reserve on it. And I don't see a sticker on it, but... This is a Trans Am that was added. That's not the original one that was here. The other one is down here further. This Trans Am and these two Trans Ams and the Camaro was here and this Trans Am was here originally. That other one has been added to it. Even have an old motorcycle Kawasaki. Look and you can get a trailer to take it home in. And these are all new that weren't here before. This one's really sharp. There was somebody else that was here who said this one probably has a locked-up engine. He said there was four cars with a locked-up engine. Doesn't know which one other than this one. Here's a money car. This is like a... I want to say it's probably a 73 Trans Am Super Duty. There's their money right there. Inside is, is in excellent condition. It has some dirt, but this is this is going to be a, an expensive car. Another Corvette like that other one. And then you have some newer Chevy trucks. This one, it's got some damage in the front, and it's got some down down there in the bed. But the the metal itself is all... It's like original paint, it's not... Oh, I mean, it does have some Bondo. Yeah, it does. It looks better than, than that, though. Big old Oldsmobile. Really straight. It still has the plastic on the seats. Then he has some super vintage. Original. Is that? He got pinstriping on the wooden wheels. I have no clue if that's original or not. 1970 was the last time it was certified on the road. Another Chevy truck. A little bit of something for everybody out here. And an IROC. So. October 15th. And this one still has the plastic on the seats as well. Even though there's a hole in the other seat. He didn't use this side. Well, there is a little bit. Never mind. Still has a plastic on it, though. Give you all another look from this side. It's almost going to be like a car show out here. This one, and it's a step side. Um, it is a two-wheel drive, 4.8 liter. Two-wheel drive is a good part about it. Inside is pretty clean. Outside it's been abused a little bit. It's high mileage. Again, that Trans Am is nice. This is 
is like completely redone. And here's some of the info on it. And you can go to that's their website online to be able to bid. So if you can't be in here in person. Catch the back side of the other cars. I can't even bring my Impala up here anymore to stick it in the middle because there's so many cars. Details for his third eye, third brake light, and his other brake lights down there. You can kind of tell when that was done because of the third brake light, but it's in really, really good shape too. You can't see in there because of the tinted windows very well. Mercedes Grand National and this is a nice Impala too and we'll turn